Hi, Aaron. Hello, hello, hello. This is Aaron from the Deep Sea Haven. Yeah. What are we doing today, Angelo? Uh, today we're doing some Commander, but we're gonna we're gonna make things uh, kind of themed. So we're gonna have Kaiju's versus Hydras. See who the big tentacly boys are gonna win. Which long neck tooth monsters are gonna gonna take the victory today? Right. What monstrosity? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna. I think I'm... we just found our name. The name for the. The video, what monstrosity. <laughs> so yeah, I'm ready whenever you are. Uh, Alright, well then let's just get right into it. So okay. So we gotta set our life total at 40 because Ooh, this is, went wow, you high. went way ahead of <laughs> um, the result. I don't know if you know this, Angelo, if you hold uh, F11, you minus, and F12, the plus. Oh, that will make my life a lot easier. Without a doubt, I've been finding more and more things. So let's right, get our so commanders gonna... out. All right. Yeah, no, we should do that first for sure. Uh, so this is what let's my commander here. does. Uh, go when, into the sideboard. <laughs> when she enters the battlefield, put X11 counters on it, where X is the greatest number, the greatest power among the creatures I control, and pretty much I draw cards equal to half of that power. So it's really nice. <laughs> That's kind of crazy. Whereas, uh, whereas I've got uh, King Ghidorah here, of course, my favorite of the kaiju's, flying, trample, mutate. Uh, I love the mutate mechanic. It, it's it's it, since its release, it's always interested me, and I I found some ways to to make it kind of cheeky. Um, but whenever he mutates, I exile cards from the top of my library until I exile non-land permanent. And put that card onto the battlefield or into my hand, in my choosing. This can make some uh, some broken boards very quickly. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Uh, let's see who wins. Let's start our draws. Oh, we have we, we got a roll also. <laughs> All right. Uh, it's fine. We can just mully these back in. Oh, somebody yeah, you're in. right. Hello. Just gonna uh, shuffle that back in. Somebody's joined. That's fine. They decide to speak. They decide to speak. If they don't, they don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I forgot I to shuffle. Who, I wonder who it is. I forgot to shuffle. Yeah, throw them back in. Uh, did we see who uh, who won that one? Because I was not looking at the thing. Uh, I rolled a. Tw you rolled a twelve. I rolled a nineteen. Oof. So I will be uh, my second. You'll be taking the draw. All right, I guess I'll be taking the play. Well, then let's get right on into it. Um, is this a better hand? <laughs> in ways, yes. In ways, no. Uh, <laughs> That's right, people. You're seeing what you think you're seeing. Things are going to get interesting. I probably shouldn't keep this, but hey... So Why not? I'm going to keep a bad hand, too, so it's okay. All right. So I'm going to technically not pass it over to you, but you're going first, so I'll let you have first. Yeah. Uh, okay, so I'm going to open with uh, Ketria Triome and pass. All right. Respect that. Not a bad land to play first. I'm uh, going yeah, to Triome, absolutely. Uh, I'm going to play Rhythmic Cave. Pretty Just much what, it, allo uh -oh. what it allows me to do is add one mana of any color unless my opponent pays one. Pretty Fair enough. Card. Uh, and I'll have to pass. Okay. Um, I'm going to untap, and I'm going to draw. Well, that helps. Um, hmm. I'm going to place a Scalding Tarn. Okay, uh, so you pretty much pay one to search one, right? Yeah, but not yet. <laughs> okay. Actually, eh, yeah, let's do that. Let's let's crack it. Ow! All right, let's view my library. Oh, it doesn't it doesn't put it into the battlefield tap, so that's actually not bad. Yeah, it's 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 a pretty good card, on his, all, all things considered. Especially if you've got a, a dual land. Um. Uh, can't helpful. you search out the tri lands too? Because technically they're forest, islands, and mountains. 
Yeah, but unfortunately, due to my color scheme, I can only play with the one try. Oh, and I already ended up with it. No. Um, so I'm actually going to go into Breeding Pool and ping myself for two so I can keep it untapped. Um, pretty good, pretty good. Let's see here. Yeah, I, I like it. Uh, it is... Then I'm going to... Okay, so your commander cost is five. Uh, five. That's not bad. Now I'm going to tap two and put down an Arcane Signet. I can tap it and add one mana of any color in my commander's color identity. So basically, add one color that I'll need. Let me draw a card. No okay. pass. Not terrible, not terrible, not mad about that. Let's play Blightened Woodlands. Ooh. I'm going to tap this because you cannot pay one mana. I'm going to choose green. I actually can. Oh, yeah, you have the Arcane, Arcane Signet. signet. You dirty, dirty boy. Uh, I know what I'm about. That completely <laughs> stops my play, so I'm going <laughs> to... This, ah, uh, I really probably should have mullied, but no, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> so we're going to untap all my permanents and get a draw. It's okay, I probably should have mullied too. Uh, I'm going to put down a reliquary tower. Uh, it um, seems like you're doing a lot better than me there, bud. <laughs> You know, I got really lucky in 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 my first draw because otherwise <laughs> I was I was not prepared to, to go. <laughs> um, mm, hard choices to make here. Hmm. I could, but I'd rather. Hmm. Hard decisions to make. Definitely. I have a bad feeling, but I'm going to go blue, green, and two. All right. And play and play uh, Rashimi, uh, Eternity's Crafter. Uh, whenever I cast my first spell each turn, uh, look at the top card of my library. If it's a non-land uh, with CMC less than uh, the first spells, mm -hmm. I may cast it without paying its mana cost. It essentially gives, uh, gives cards... Cascade? Like a half a half version of Cascade. Okay. Okay, that's pretty good. Um, other than that, I got nothing, so I'm going to pass. Okay, I'm going to untap. Draw. Oh, no. Land. Finally, yes. Mmm, delicious. Mmm, a basic forest. Yum. <laughs> Listen, I'll take it. I'm going to play my druid. Pretty much, I can Ooh. tap her for one green, or I can tap her at uh, two. This mana can only be used to cast a kick. Spells. Ooh, 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 not liking that. Not liking that at I all. I don't have that many kicks, okay? It's fine. <laughs> you can't just say, it's fine, that's the voice of doom. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to pass the turn. Hope the best for you. Alright, I'm going to untap and draw. And I mean, I hoped for the best for me, but uh, it, it didn't... Uh... Didn't really turn out the best. Uh, Sad boy hours. Yeah, I I can't let you keep that elf. Well, I, I can't uh, allow you to keep your person, but I can't get rid. I can't let you get rid of your elf right now. You're mean. <laughs> well, I don't want to be mean, but at the same time, I literally have no other plays. Oh, you're going to be this guy right now. All right. What I mean, it might work do? out in your favor. Uh, let's find out. Uh, let's go red and colorless. Chaos Warp. Uh, I'm going to have you uh, shuffle that, uh, that elf back into your deck. And then uh, you're going to look at the top card of your library. If it's permanent, you can put it onto the battlefield. Okay, so I put this on top. So that's not the worst shuffle. thing, right? Shuffle, yeah. Draw the card. And oh, then... sorry. I'm supposed to tap three, not two. Uh, reveal it. Okay. Uh, it hits the battlefield. There's the battlefield with four plus one plus ones. See, it works out in your favor. Yeah, but like, oh, he could have been so much better. He could have been stronger. Actually, no, no, no. He he will always come in with four plus one plus ones. So you actually just got a free four four oh, yeah, that right, can yeah. make himself stronger. Um, all right. Uh, with that, uh, Rashini's gonna trigger. 
Okay. I'm going to look at the top card. Uh, it's a non-land card. Uh, so you get to play it? Less CMC. Uh, so you get to look the top uh, cards of your library, put them back in any order, yeah. you may shuffle your library, draw one card. Okay, so it's pretty much... Yeah, gonna... That's not bad. All right. All right, so we're going to view the top three cards, right? And that's what Ponder does. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. I put them back in any order, and then I get a draw. Hmm. Not certain how to feel about any of that. Uh, I really missed, missed that mana flowing. I'll, I'll, I'll leave them as they are, get my draw, hit my... Uh, <clears throat> Land drop. Come in, uh, Wonderful. Uh, this is such a good card. And then I'll pass. Untap, and I will draw. Okay. Love to see this card. Play Quarry at the beginning of my end step. If you control no creature, sacrifice it. So, pretty much I ah, have to have a creature. So, Hero's Bane is going to keep it alive. <laughs> and uh, it can tap for one of any mana, any color to my pool. Oh, that's that's pretty. So pretty. Um, All right. So this one, is the point in the game where things are going to get a little two, aggressive on both sides of the battlefield, three. huh? Yep, I'm going to play my Hydra. Oh, no! <laughs> it has trampled. Oh, look, I have a friend. Oh, wait, that's not a friend. That's a threat. Uh, whenever a player, any player, casts a spell, put a 1-1 counter on him. Yeah, I don't like that. You should stop that. Uh, as a matter of fact... Don't do anything. Leave my Hydras alone. I... I, I can let that sit. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Right, he's not that big yet. <laughs> yet. That's the problem. The yet. <laughs> oh, it's fine. Alright. Now I'm gonna pass. Alright, relax. Oh, Everything is okay. Oh. Oh, I'm not going to swing yet. Passed. I I feel I feel like I can breathe suddenly. <laughs> right, I'm not going to swing yet. I don't have draw. that big of hydras. Yet. <laughs> Listen, I need the mana too, all right? And I'm kind of struggling at the moment. Where's all my mana ramp? <laughs> right. <laughs> I'm wondering that myself. All right, so let's see here. At least you have Arcane Signet. Green, blue, one... Two, three. Okay. Nissa. So that's, uh... uh what is your zero? Look at the top card of your library if it's a land or card or a creature card with infinite many cards. Less than or equal to the number of total loyalty counters on these. Yeah, put that card on. Oh, that's wonderful. And I can't read the bottom effect because it's hidden. That, that's great. Oh, uh... Untap up to two target lands I control. They become five five elemental creatures with flying and haste until the end of the turn. They're still lands, and that's a minus six. Ah! <laughs> at least like anyone actually zero. uses that ability, but hey. Uh, what uh, is she starting at three? Yeah. Okay. Because yeah, uh, Rash attacks. Rashimi's going to okay. trigger. Uh, so anything less five? than a five. There we go. You get a land, buddy. <laughs> Do you get the land? Uh, okay, so I can put it in my hand. You have a hand to play so, this turn. So I'm gonna put it put it on the on the battlefield, and it's tapped. And I'm gonna send back my. Uh, why not? I'm gonna send back my command tower. Uh, from there, I'm gonna go. Uh, Plus two, to just look at the top two for myself. You're already at five. That is terrifying. Eh, she, she's not meant for her minus. I understand that. The five fives are pretty good. The problem is they have flying. That's my big problem with those creatures. That's just mm, ten I damage. Actually don't, I actually don't... Uh, let's, let's move that to the bottom. I... Uh, hmm. And by the way, if you want to see either that. perspective, Angel will be uploading his on his channel, and I'll be uploading mine on my channel. So yeah, if you want to see both perspectives of these matches, I think it'd be a pretty good idea. The Battle of Monsters. <laughs> it's, uh, it's, 
I don't know. I'm I'm, I'm pretty pleased with uh, the concept we're running with here. Uh, I'm I'm gonna pass. Uh, uh, don't forget to put a plus on your mana gorger there. Yep. My god, rocket! Awesome, another forest. Whoa! I'm gonna tap. You you're gonna pay one so I can't? Oh no, you can't. Hey. No, I can't. I can't. Tap. For this. Ooh, color fixing. It's wonderful. I don't know how much you need color fixing, considering you only have two colors. I think I'd be more likely to need it than you. To be honest, what do you not see color-wise on my field? Blue. Blue? Well, exactly. I mean, you've got you've got your friend Quarry and Rhystic Cave, so you can make blue without an issue. If you tap out. That's that's the thing. And I cast a spell, so... You could have also, uh, you know, done your, done your thing with Blighted Woodland and, you know, searched two basics. Yeah, but I like it just as it appear colorless, to be honest. I don't, I don't mind the two basics if I have the extra mana to, you know what I mean, afford to do so. That's fair. But for now, I just needed another blue so that way I can start playing other cards in my hand. But for now, I think I'm just going to chill. Uh, I don't think you're going to block with her. I really don't. Why not? You don't know me. So I'm going to move to <laughs> combat. Sure. Just the mana gorger? Yep. You can't kill him unless you pop down something, but you don't have the mana too. Alright. And pass. That's that, that's fine. I, uh, I know you said you're not going to use it to make your things all scary, but I prefer not. Even still. <laughs> I mean, it only makes two... Two lands, uh, elementals, and that's only till the end of the turn. That's for like, uh, if I need to take a swing for ten, uh, then that'd be the time. But that's that's definitely not what I use her for. Uh, so I'm gonna play a command tower. Um. Oh my god! Who would have guessed? It's too big. Too big. Oh my god! Uh, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. Plus two with my Nisa. And I'm going to look at the two uh, the top cards in my deck. Hmm. I actually don't want either of those. So I'm going to put those in the bottom. You worry me because you said you could have countered my little Hydra. So, like, now I don't want to play anything big. <laughs> I didn't say I could counter it. Oh, hold up. I'll, I'll be clear. I didn't say I could counter it. I didn't say anything, actually, but uh, I alluded to the fact that I could do something. Exactly. <laughs> that's that's not comfortable, all right? That's not a comfortable position to be in. That's fair. I'm now that I have tap, enough mana to play. I'm going to tap uh, Gruel Turf okay. uh, to cast uh, Regrowth. Regrowth? Uh, I'm going to bring uh, Ponder back to my hand. Okay. Are you going to cast Ponder? Uh not yet. Uh, Rashimi's going to trigger. Rashimi. Yep, so you could do it for two? two? Uh, yep. One. One. And then oh. this just goes in my hand because it ain't yep. working. It's uh, not a bad card to get to hand, though. Yeah, really. Uh, then I'm going to cast Ponder. Okay. If I could have, you know, chained those out differently, I totally would have. Uh, let me look at the top three. Ooh, 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 don't know what to do here. Eef. Hmm. Do I want to? Nah, not really. All right. I'm going to leave it like that, and I'm going to get the rip. Uh, let's see here. Hmm. I'm just not sure how I want to do anything at this point. The fun of magic. <laughs> What's so funny? 
Yeah, I think I'm just gonna gonna pass. Respect it. I will untap. I'm going to draw a card. Mm -hmm. I'm going to play down mana per turn. I oh. can uh, uh, pretty much it just taps for one uh, colorless, or I could use three and tap to draw a card. Activate this ability only if you control a creature with four greater power. So power, which you already have ready with Heroes Bane. Mm -hmm. I kind of played myself with that one. <laughs> uh. All right, let's. You got me in like a weird spot right now. You're getting more mana, and I don't like it. I don't like it that you can stop something. So I'm gonna go one, two. That's blue. So actually, let me go blue and blue. That'd be two, three. There we go. For Jace's intuition. Uh, stand by. Uh, I'm going to tap one down for no risk to caves. You'll have to tap something else to get Jace's. Oh uh, no, I'm, I'm I'm using uh, chromatic lantern and quarry. Oh. Yeah. Get out of here. Nice. One, two, three. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And that card costs... Yeah, that card costs five. You need to tap one more down either way. One, two, oh, three, wait, chromatic four, lantern. five. Yeah. <laughs> I keep forgetting chromatic lantern taps on its own. It doesn't just make other things tap. It's more uh, interesting than that. I can do more next turn. Started combat. What? I already clicked started combat, bastard. There we go. It's gonna go out of your way to kill the Nissa. Yeah, right. I don't. I don't like you being able to search like that. I really don't. I mean, I'm not searching. I'm just scrying. But I get it. She did. Ghetto searching. <laughs> Get, ghetto searching is Rashini. <laughs> um. Rosh me, Rashini. Rosh me. <laughs> they both tap. Ooh, they're tabbed. Pass. All right. Here's where things get fun. I'm going to untap. And then I'm going to draw. Ooh, who would have ever guessed? Uh, <laughs> could do that. That'd be silly. Uh, okay, I guess I'm just going to... One, two, lightning greaves. <laughs> um, you get the plus wing. No. <clears throat> All right. Now I've got... What, mana gorger? Yeah. yeah okay. uh, then, then I've got Rashmi triggering, which I'm pretty sure I know. Yeah, that's going in my hand. Then I'm going to land drop. <laughs> okay. Um... Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. Um, I could do that, but that'd be silly. Uh, I'm just gonna... Okay. It's time. Uh, I forget how to do this properly, so... Yeah, I knew it was going to be wrong. <laughs> uh, I'm going to mutate Rashmi into Aluna. Aluna's going to trigger. Okay. So, so I'm going to exile cards off the top of my deck. Five. Ooh, I'm going to definitely make that one hit the board. Uh, you can't cast spells with even converted mana costs. Um... And you can't block with creatures with even converted mana costs. Uh, then I'm going to put Lightning Greaves on it. Right? 
Oh, you, I thought I thought you fully tapped down. No, it's zero. Yeah. Yeah, it's zero. it costs zero. <laughs> uh, then I'm gonna swing eleven at you with Void Winworth. I'm gonna have to accept it. And then I'm gonna pass. I'm going to untap. I'm going to draw. You didn't give him a plus for Void Winnower, did you? Because uh, no. Void Winnower was never cast. No. I gave it for uh, your commander, and that's it. Ah, fair enough. I'm going to play my island, my land for turn. Okay. Well, this game just got... Uh... It just shifted the switch One, really two, hard. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, I forgot to hit my Rashmi trigger. Uh. Ooh. Uh. Okay, so that's eight. Perfect. Wasn't kicked. Mm, nope. But this becomes... That's <clears throat> torture becomes a six six. This is difficult. I I'm gonna have to pass. All right, let's get to the untapping, guys, and then I'm gonna draw. Uh, I, I, I mean, I guess I could just, that would be, that would be rude of me. Uh, let's see here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> uh... Green, red, and uh, colorless. Cultivate. Okay. okay. Uh, I'm gonna just search my library. Do you have a response to that? Oh wait, you're all tapped yeah, out. Yeah, I'm all tapped out. Uh, I'm a. Uh, and to be honest, it, like two, for some reason, two like basics. Yeah, two basics. Perfect. Uh, I'm gonna put this down tapped, and I'm gonna put uh, this one into my hand. Um, and I'm always confused about this. That doesn't count as my land drop, does it? Uh, no, because they're, it's putting it on by that effect, so it's not part of your land drop now. Okay, so land drop. One, two, three, four, five, six. Cute. Um... So um, I, he also gets a plus one, plus one counter. So. Uh, I'll also trigger the Rashmi effect, uh, attached to a Luna. Mm-hmm. Or Same a Luna, thing. Ghidorah. Yeah. So let's, let's see. Oh, it goes into my hand. All right. Um, let's see here. I'm going to do this the smart way. Don't know. Well, that'll help. Uh, I'm going to swing six through the sky at you. Can't block it. <laughs> all right. All right. Uh, and that's that's, uh, that's all I got for now. Pass. Okay, I'm going to untap. Mm-hmm. going to play an Eland. An Eland? Who do you think you are playing Elans? I'll do whatever I want to with Elans. Oh. Uh, I'm going to tap one, two, three. For this. Already not my, liking that. For my elf. When it adds the uh, to the battlefield, I can search my library for a basic land card, put it onto my battlefield tap, and then shuffle my library. I. Uh, no, 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 no. Why not? <laughs> nope, nope, nope. The, 
Ghidorah, this is what a beast elemental dinosaur looks like. It's, it's not wrong. Still certainly odd. Right. Not incorrect. <laughs> yeah, so I'm gonna grab an Ewind. Ooh. Uh, he gets a 1-1 counter because she drew, she entered the battlefield. Uh, mm -hmm. the spiel. Um, it's, it's occurring to me. Did you cast Slin Vada before or after Void Winor hit the field? Hmm? Too late to change it now, but did you cast your uh, big Leviathan before or after Void Winor hit the field? Oh, uh, that was last turn. So, after. Yeah, yeah you shouldn't have been able to do that, but uh, I already screwed it up, so it's it's here. <laughs> no, I, didn't, I had enough mana. I just added this mana yeah, this turn. Void Winor, you can't cast... Uh, can't cast things with even converted mana costs, and his is eight. Oh, yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. Completely forgot about that. But it's too late. We're here now. Big boy facts. That definitely puts me in a poor situation. Uh, I'm happy because I'm almost as big as your Eldrazi, at least. I'm getting there. Right. Uh, I'm going to tap this for green, this for green, this for colorless, this for colorless to put double heroes ban. So now he's 8-8. Uh, eight, eight. Okay. And and if I do it again, he'll just continue to double. That's, that's so pretty. <laughs> Only if I have more mana to play with, that's actually tapped. So I have one mana open and it's a blue. Uh, I got you a blue. <laughs> uh, for now, I guess I'm going to have to pass, unfortunately. Alright, so I'm going to untap and I'm going to get my rip. Uh, I'm going to put down Stomping Ground. Of shock land, so I'm gonna take two to keep it up. Yep. Uh, let's see here. How to do this properly? I'm not gonna be able to continue to take hits from your six six. This it's gonna be bad. I'm gonna just tap all that down and play omniscience. Uh, what does that do? Uh, I may cast spells from my hand without paying their mana cost. I hate you. I hate you. Want to have a fun game? Oh my god. <laughs> um, um, I get. I get. A, I guess I get a one one counter. Uh, Rashmi's gonna trigger. Yep. So into my hand. Awesome. Um, Yay! <laughs> At least it wasn't something stupid, ridiculous. Uh, it's gonna be stupid ridiculous, though. Uh, you're not gonna like this. I'm gonna find it hilarious, but you're not gonna like it. Uh, I'm gonna cast Evacuation for free. Return all creatures to their owner's hands. Okay. Game? I'm even gonna put a Luna in there. <laughs> this is game. I, I can't come back. Probably, uh, probably not. Uh, I mean, cast Void Winor for free. Cast Rashmi for free. Uh, cast ne Nezahal for free. Uh, uh, Dockside Extortionist. He's gonna make a treasure because you got Chromatic Lantern. And not like the treasure is really relevant here, but you know, um. Right. At least there's one good thing about this. Riku of two reflections. <sighs> At least you don't have uh <laughs> what's it called? Uh haste. <laughs> uh I mean I do still have the lightning grooves on. 
Right, but you can't kill me at least. Like you have no future. That's, that's high true. That's true. Uh, I'm gonna put lightning greaves on my void winner and swing eleven at you. I think that's right. And then I'm gonna pass. On I was waiting for since roll. turn one to play on missions. Um, I'm going to one, two, three, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Breaching Leviathan. Uh, all non-breach uh, creatures get tapped, and they don't untap during their next untap phase. Yeah, I can't let that happen. <laughs> you gotta let me play, man. <laughs> Uh, you're tapping everything. Uh, cast it from your hand. Tap all non-blue creatures. They don't untap during their controller's next untap step. Y you know what? Honestly, that's not uh, that's not too crazy an issue for me. Right. I mean, you still got your primal uh, guy and your void walker. Down, it, it literally just tap, tap down dockside extortionists. Everything else has blue in it. Void Winor was already tapped, so. And since he wasn't tapped by the effect of Breaching Leviathan, he'll untap next turn. Yep. I'm going to have to pass. This, this is GG. I can't do anything about this. This is so unfortunate. <laughs> uh, again, I've been sitting on Omniscient since turn one waiting to get the mana for it. Uh... <sighs> I'm going to and see. Here's the thing, because uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna go one uh, red, green, blue, blue. What are you tapping for? You can just cast anything. No, because my mutate cost uh, is a different oh. uh, different thing. Yeah, you're right. So yeah. wait, that's one, two, three, four, five. You already got death on board. Six. Mutating, uh, I don't know. uh, mutating onto Rashmi again, uh, Aluna triggers, non-land permanent, so let's keep going, bam, bam, that's helpful, uh, Zendikar Resurgent hits the board, uh, whenever I tap a land for mana, I add one, not that that really matters, uh, whenever I cast a creature spell, I draw one. Rashmi trigger uh, for, I don't know, five? Eh, not helpful. <laughs> what do you um, mean helpful? You have game one. <laughs> oh my god, I've not been paying attention to your life total at all. Yeah, literally. I've seen it now and I'm like, oof. Yeah, I, I, it's, it's GT dog. <laughs> uh... Yeah, I suppose it is. Um, because if you tap with uh, everything, oh. even the goblin, I can only tap your big guy. That would bring you up to... Oh, no, that only brings you up to oh, the go 11. The goblin stayed tapped. Um, yeah, it only brings you up to 11. I'm at uh, 9 right here. Because if I block your big guy, I don't technically die. Huh. Uh, well, I'm not going into combat... Yes, kind of. Oh, wrong thing. Let's try that again. Uh, attach. Attach to you. Excuse me, I said let's attach. All right. Uh, so I'm gonna swing. Eleven, six through the air, and seven on the ground. Uh. Seven, or, I'm sorry, 11, 7, and 2 on the ground, and 6 through the air. Even if you do block my Void Winnower, 7, Game. 6, and 2 would be enough. I'm going to concede. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I mean, that was, that was good. It just it, it, There was the one card I was waiting on that turned the tides. 
Yeah, I just I wasn't getting any of my counter spells. I wasn't getting any of my draw power. It's okay. You no, know, I held off on a mana drain that was sitting in my hand that whole time and an arcane denial because I wanted things to progress. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this is Aaron from Deep Sea Haven saying peace, peace, and chicken grease. Hopefully you did enjoy. This is my buddy Angelo from the Eldritch Realm. Ah, Eldritch Realms. So yeah, if you want to check out their channel, go ahead. Uh, you'll see his perspective over there, and you'll see game two from our match. So yeah, all right, peace, peace.